Let me tell you about the woman who fell from the sky. Look, another one. Ah, you've told that story a thousand times. I've heard enough of flying women. I heard you saw something interesting. As clearly as I see you. Amazing. I look into the sky. But wait. You must buy a fellow a drink for such a story. Well, you shut it already. We can already cite this bullshit now. I'm a client and I'll say what I want. Pour me some Mahakam and Mead and no cheating. This noble wayfarer will pay. I'll pay, but if you bore me, I'll shove this meat up your ass. For such a fine liquor. And my ass has no taste. <laughs> you won't regret it. Speak. Last week I was passing by the gullies. I like to take a hike from time to time. Get to the point. Hush. So I'm walking and suddenly there's a flash. A crack. I'm thinking, a storm's coming. But nearly a cloud in the sky. You hit the ground with your arse so hard you saw a flash. You were that drunk. Then I saw people lying in a gully as if they'd fallen from the sky. A man and a woman. The woman was so beautiful, I wished she'd fallen down on me. Get a good look at the man. Huge fella. His mug cut up like he shaved with a scythe while drunk. What did the woman look like? A redhead. Wearing a vest and high shoes with pear tits and a round arse. Just waiting to be grabbed and... That sounds just like your old lady. Shut your mouth. What happened then? Well, the woman was hurting. Couldn't get up. The man clearly disliked her, because he didn't help her. He just stood there, menacing and talking. And then he left, and the redhead stayed. Noticed her tits, but didn't even try to help her, you sod. I was about to do exactly that when a troll came out of the gully, ugly as shit after blueberries. Did it attack her? Not at all. I hid and saw everything. First he sniffed her, so I thought he'd eat her. But he didn't. He threw her over his shoulder like a sack and returned to the gullies. Is that all? Yes. Didn't waste your money, as you'll agree. Take care, what's up? The woman who fell from the sky. Again. Humans are strange. Let's hear it. See, when they're to marry, they become terribly picky. 
Have to check it. I thought we had a basilisk in the basement. You repair off. Right. You work just not just. You don't say much, do you? And they said you're grumpy. Whether the bride's been ploughed, has a you dowry, is bear diligent. Or what? Claims she's a virgin, and nobody questions her virtue. Let's go drink, friends. I'm gonna get us drunk. Fat Gern. I'm glad to see you again. Again? Plotsam? The fire? Funny how these things work. I'll never forget that. Oh, unimportant. Needless to say, I'm deeply indebted. Hmm. Sorry. No need to be. But I feel I should pay you back somehow. I've started anew here, you know. That always builds confidence. Sure I can't tempt you with something. Wait a minute. Is this what I think it is? It is if you want it to be. We elves might seem strange by your standards. You saved my life. A bit of joy as recompense is not too much to ask. That's not necessary. As you wish. Though you realize I'll not offer again. Sulfur.
Greetings. 